Tonight, as part of our series of reports on what works, a story about those among us with special needs, people with drive and ability who are seldom able to find a good job. A national employer with a big name is out to change that. Our What Works report tonight from NBC's Mika Brzezinski. For Julia Turner, born with Down syndrome, a full-time job might seem out of reach, but not here. I have found what I want, and I'm satisfied. At this new Walgreens distribution center, Julia thrives. So does Tommy Watson. Asperger syndrome makes him developmentally disabled in some ways, but when it comes to computers... If there's a problem, who do they call? Calling me. It's amazing. Walgreens has tapped into the talents of a segment of the population that often struggles to find work. It's what you do, breathe life into it all. It was company vice president Randy Lewis's idea. His son Austin has autism. Austin's gift to me was to look past the disability to see a person. And here, Lewis has hired many people. More than 40% of the workers at this warehouse have a disability. The building is designed to accommodate just about anyone with touch screens and flexible workstations. Everybody comes in, everybody works side by side. Same pay, the playing fields. same pay, same job, same performance. Yeah. And this setup is also good for business. This distribution center is 20% more efficient than any in the entire company. That's why other companies are now looking at the Walgreens model, one that's faster and easier to use. And the payback goes far beyond profitability because Lewis knows firsthand the questions that haunt parents of the disabled. Is that a good plan for you? Of course. <laughs> what would happen after I'm gone? Can I live that one day longer than, than my child? For Tommy Watson's mother, Diane, that question is now answered. I don't have to have that worry anymore. So he's going to be took care of here. As long as he performs his job and does his best for Walgreens, he's got a home. A home for Tommy and Julia. Hello, Julia. <laughs> because now... Did you have a good day? I had a wonderful day. Oh, no, Just about did. anyone can fit <laughs> into the Walgreens workforce. Mika Brzezinski, NBC News, Anderson, South Carolina. There you go. That's our broadcast for this Monday night, the 2nd of July. Thank you for being with us. I'm Brian Williams. We'll look for you right back here tomorrow evening. Good night.